Yo, what is going on guys? It is District Training here bringing you guys this brand new video. Now today guys, we're going to be going over why Lil Uzi Vert changed his appearance by changing up his hair color to red and also getting a couple new face tattoos. But before we do, if you guys are a Lil Uzi Vert fan, I need you to leave a like on this video because I do want to see how many of his fans are watching this video. And if you'd like a shout out in my next video, just comment down below your three favorite songs by Lil Uzi Vert and you'll be entered to win. And we're also giving away an iPhone X at the end of the month, so if you guys would like to win that, just subscribe to my channel and then just watch this video fully through because I'll get into more detail about how to win at the end. So anyways guys, today we're going to be talking about why Lil Uzi Vert changed his appearance and there's actually a few reasons for this honestly. Many people want to know more about his face tattoos but sadly I don't know the exact meaning behind each one but I can tell you guys most of the stuff that I do know about his face tattoos. Lil Uzi Vert actually got a couple new face tattoos that are a little bit questionable I actually have no idea what they actually mean so I do really need your guys help on this so just make sure you guys keep watching till the part where I talk about his face tattoos and then you guys can help me out with it. But I'll show you guys right now on the screen of Lil Uzi Vert's brand new appearance. So what you guys notice right off the bat is going to be his new red hair. Lil Uzi Vert likes to change his hair color a lot and just keeping his style fresh at all times. So this is kind of just like how he likes to be. Lil Uzi Vert is a very different type of music artist, especially nowadays. He likes to dress a lot different than most of these other artists. That's one thing that he actually gets some hate for in the music scene though, is how he dresses. Sometimes he kind of dresses a little bit feminine and people like to attack him over like Twitter and other social medias for that for some odd reason like just as an example i don't know how many guys actually are low Vert fans if you do know then you definitely would have heard about this or you if you're just like really active on any social media you probably know about this but i'll be showing you guys a picture if i can find it he's kind of wearing this stretched out neck pink and black striped t-shirt or like long sleeved shirt I guess it's a girl shirt on some clothing website that he bought and he really wanted to wear it or something. But he was getting roasted online about this for I swear it was like two weeks long. People weren't just giving up about this. I honestly have no idea what's the, really the big deal. If Lou he wants to dry, like, dress like that, it's not really that big of a deal. He was getting roasted for this so much online. But honestly, I think that's why, kind of why he likes to change his hair color so much. Because he just doesn't care about what other people think at all. Which is a really good thing, especially nowadays. Nowadays, you can do anything and somebody will find something something to like make fun about it you can buy a brand new watch and somebody will make fun of you like why didn't you get this one or that one's cheap or something so guys if you buy something that you like who cares if people make fun of it? It doesn't really matter at all. But I think the red hair actually looks really good on him, and so do a lot of other people. So I don't think this was a bad move made by him at all. Let me know what you guys think down below of his hair and what color you prefer, because he has had many different colors of hair. Like, in the video clips that are on the screen right now that you guys can see, in one scene he has, like, pink hair, the other scene he has black hair. He even had blue and orange hair at one point. Like, he just keeps dyeing his hair. It's just something that he likes to do. So the next thing that he changed about his appearance was a couple, he got a couple new face tattoos. Now he definitely is known for having face tattoos and just a lot of tattoos in general, so it didn't really come to a shock to me when he got new ones. Getting face tattoos is a pretty big way for hip hop artists nowadays. They've been getting them for years and people don't really care too much when they get them, but if a regular person who just works like a nine to five job gets a face tattoo, it's pretty much the end of the world. Although if you are a regular person, you get do get a face tattoo that works a nine to five, you'll definitely be getting five from that job especially if it's like a job where you have to be interacting with people but with that being said Uzi did in fact get a brand new face tattoo I'll have it up on the screen for you guys and see what you guys think about it I honestly cannot tell you for the life of me exactly what this is but it kind of looks like some sort of like tribe member or something like that I honestly have no idea if you guys have an idea of what it is please comment down below because I'll most likely be making a video about this tattoo and all of his other tattoos just because that is a very popular topic on like hip-hop artists nowadays and if you do get it right I'll be shouting you out in the video that I do make talking about his tattoos just because you helped me find this I honestly thought he would have got a tattoo of Marilyn Manson on his cheek instead of whatever this is actually this could be Marilyn Manson for all I know I have no idea but if you don't know that is one of Louis E. Vert's biggest idols he's looked up to Marilyn Manson his whole childhood and he still does even today he even got a hundred thousand dollar chain of Marilyn Manson made to wear if you guys don't believe me I'll put a picture up on the screen of the chain it's actually a pretty sweet chain I can only imagine that thing's pretty heavy though like I don't know how people wear all these chains like Lil Yachty has like 30 chains that he wears at a time it's absolutely ridiculous and they're all like big ones as well I don't know if they're heavy or what but they're, they look pretty heavy now just before we end this video guys I need to shout out my man Park he actually just released this really sweet freestyle that I'm going to be showing you guys and if you like his style of music please be sure to go down to the description below and check him out he's a very underrated music artist and he makes some really good music so here I hope you guys all like this wait I sleep 24 
ain't sleeping 24. Ah. Uh. Still, I can go for more. I ain't sleeping 24. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't sleeping 24. So yeah, if you definitely enjoyed that, be sure to go check him out. He's very underrated. If you guys are a fan, if you guys go check him out and become a fan, he'll definitely be responding to you guys like on Twitter and things. But anyways, guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please smack a like on it. Subscribe to District Trending if you guys haven't already. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm out. Peace. Just before we get into the video, I just want to let you guys know we are doing an iPhone X giveaway at the end of the month. If you'd like to enter, just subscribe to my channel, turn on channel notifications, leave a like on the video, then watch this video fully through, then go to the description down below and click the iPhone X giveaway link. Follow the simple rules and you'll be entered to win.